Oh, let's go. Hi everybody, give me a wave if you can hear me. Super, that's just what I like to see. Right. What I'm gonna, while we're waiting for the last few people to join in, I'm just gonna explain what we're gonna do. So, those of you who did this session last week, is exactly the same format, so we're gonna do what I'm gonna call a pyramid workout, but it's more like an upside down pyramid. So we've got six exercises, which we're gonna break into two groups of three. You're going to do the first set of three, three times, and then you're going to get a 30 second rest. Second set of three, three times, 30 second rest. Back to the first set, doing two rounds, two rounds of the second set, one round of the first set, one round of the second set. So exactly the same format as last week. The same as last week. If you need to take a rest halfway through because you got a bit over hot or you need a breath, that is absolutely fine. I'd rather see you doing as much as it's best as you can with the odd little rest as and when you need it. You will get a 15 second rest between each exercise anyway. Um, when you get your 30 second rests or when you get any rest ever, get, grab yourself a drink. If you're running out of breath, hands above your head, open up your lungs to make sure you're getting lots of air in. And remember it is hot today. So if you need a break, please take a break. Right, let's explain what exercises we're doing today. So Josie's gonna show you. We're gonna start with 30 seconds of squat jumps. So feet apart, no wrong ones, Josie. <laughs> squat jumps, feet apart, pushing your knees forwards over your legs. But this time we're not doing the squat jump resets. We're just doing squat jump and then straight away into another one. So no straightening your legs, you go down and then you push off the floor every single time. Then you're gonna go into front support. We're gonna do press up jacks. So. All you're gonna do, in front support, jump your feet out and back in. If you want to make it even harder, but I'm not sure why you would, but if you do, you're, when you jump your feet out, you can also jump your hands out or you can add a press up in if you'd like to make it harder. Then we've got rebound jump. So either arms above your ears or you can use your arms here to give you a bit of height and momentum. So what well, key things to remember here is we want nice straight legs and pointed toes where possible. Then you'll get your 30 second rest once you've done three rounds of those. The next set is our plyo jump. So one leg in front, you bend down, knee just off the floor and you jump, you swap legs, getting as much height off that floor as possible. Then into plank, are you just gonna hold plank for 30 seconds? This is your chance to breathe, try and cool down. And then the last one you're going to do, back in our squat shape, so we're trying to keep our backs nice and straight and our bums down, we're going to do what we are called squat jacks. So all you're going to do in squat, feet together, feet apart, together, apart. Nice and easy. You don't straighten your legs at all. You keep your bum low, keep your legs bent. Anyone, everyone got it? Give me a wave now if you're not sure. No, we all look happy. So up we get... Make sure you've got some water nearby and let's get ready for squat jumps. Ready in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go. Squat jumps, pushing up as high as you can off that floor, using those arms, nice and powerful. Big jumps. This is really working on your explosive movements, which is really important for our tumbling. So let's see you really working, squeezing those legs, getting as high off the floor as possible. Nearly done with this round. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Well done, super job. 15 seconds, then we're going into our press up jacks. So in our front support shapes, feet are apart and back together. Getting ready in five seconds. Three, two, one, and go. So here, what I want you to remember is to keep your tummies nice and squeezed, keep your backs rounded, arms nice and straight, and keep your legs straight. Don't let those bums creep up. Well done, everybody. Super work so far. Halfway there. Keep those legs nice and tight. 
Good job, everybody. Nearly done. Three, two, one, and rest. Good job. Last one for this round is rebound jump. So nice straight legs, nice pointed toes, keeping our tummies nice and tall. That's it. Three, two, one, and go. Rebound jumps. Nice and squeeze, use those arms. If you're not quite sure what to do if they're by your sides, don't be afraid to put them up by your ears to help you out. Good job, everybody. Keep those ankles squeezed together. I don't see any ankles coming apart. Toes nice and pointed. Good job. Nearly finished. Well done, everybody. Three, two, one, and rest. Well done. We've got 15 seconds and we're back to our squat jumps. Good job. Five seconds to go. Three, two, one, and squat jumps. Really powerful, really push through the floor. Use those legs, keep your backs nice and straight in your squat. Bend those knees, push your knees forwards over your toes. Don't let them go out to the side. Make sure they go forwards over your toes. 10 seconds to go. Keep it up. Well done. Three, two, one, and rest. Good job, everybody. Next, we've got our squat jumps. So in our front support shape, feet out and in, keeping our backs nice and straight. You're all doing a really good job so far, so I want you to keep it up. Three, two, one, and go. Nice, fast feet here. Staying on your toes, keeping your ankles nice and strong. Don't let them roll out. Well done, everybody. Keep it up. That's it. Good job. Well done, everybody. 10 seconds to go. Keep working really hard. Three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Good job. You're over halfway through this set now. So the next one we're going to do is our rebound jump. So remember, arms either by your sides or off above. But the most important thing is we keep our toes together, toes pointed and legs straight. Ready in three, two, one and go. Nice straight legs. Squeeze those ankles together. Keep your body nice and straight. So squeezing your core. Just because it's our legs working doesn't mean our other muscles shouldn't be working too. So squeeze that core, squeeze your bum. You're over halfway through now, so keep it up. Well done, everybody. Good work. Finishing in three, two, one, and rest. Well done, that's two rounds completed, just one to go. So we're going back to our squat jumps in 10 seconds, and then you get a 30 second rest after this round. So getting ready in three, two, one, and go. What's really important is you try and make the last set as good as your first set. That's how we build up our stamina, which is really important for gymnastics. So make that last, make this third set as good as the first one you did. You're all doing a really good job, keep it up. You're over halfway through. Make sure those knees are pushing forwards over your toes. Good job, everybody. Keep it up. Three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Right, next we've got our press-up jacks. You're doing a super job, everybody. So keep it up. Keep working nice and hard. Getting ready in. Three, two, one, and go. Nice, fast feet. Keeping your backs nice and tight. Don't let your bums creep up. Again here, you should be squeezing your tummies, using your shoulders. All those muscles should be working. Well done. You're halfway through this. Keep going, you're all doing a really good job. Well done. Three, two, one, and rest. Well done, right, last exercise for this round is our rebound jumps. So last 30 seconds of exercise and you get a whole 30 second rest. Well done, ready in three, two, one and go. 
That's it. So again, squeezing those ankles together, pointing your toes, keeping your legs nice and straight. Make sure you're working as hard as you can. Well done, everybody. I'm seeing some fantastic work. I'm really proud of you all, so keep it up. You're halfway through. Squeeze those toes, try and push up as high as you can. Well done. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Well done, you've got 30 seconds. Grab yourself a drink, arms above your head if you need to get some air in. This is some fantastic work you're doing so far though, everybody. So in the next round, we've got our plyo jumps, followed by our plank, and then our squat jacks. So we'll talk you through them as we go. But the first one, one foot in front, bending that knee so it's nearly touching the floor, and then jumping up. You've got five seconds. So getting ready in three, two, one for our plyo jumps. So big push. Get that knee as close to the floor as you can without letting it touch. And then try and jump as high as you can. Use those leg muscles. I know you've all got them because I've known, I know all of you have been working really hard. So jump up nice and tall. Well done, everybody. Nearly done. Good work. Three, two, one, and rest. Well done, everybody. That's exercise one done. Next, we've got our planks so on our elbows with our backs nice and flat. And you're just gonna hold it. I know you can all do this. So ready in three, two, one, and go. So back's nice and flat. Squeeze that core, squeeze those muscles. Well done, everybody. So on those elbows, nice and tight. Good job, everybody. Halfway through already. Good work. Make sure you're breathing. So make sure you're breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth. Finishing in three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Next one we've got is our squat jacks. So in our squat shape, we're going to jump our feet together and apart. So members keep those bums nice and low. Ready in three, two, one, and go. That's it, like this. So try not to let your legs straight and try and keep yourself nice and steady. Keep those legs nice and bent, that's it. Good work, everyone. Good job, this is fantastic, keep it up. 10 seconds to go. Well done. Keep your body nice and low. So bum nice and low. Three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Good job. One more exercise of this round. You're all doing super. I know it's hot, so I'm really proud of all of you. Getting ready in three, two, one. Getting ready for our plyo jumps. So back to one foot in front, big jumps. Good work, everybody. Try and get that knee as close to the ground as you can. It should be just above the floor without touching it. The lower you go, the stronger you're gonna make those legs of yours. Good work, keep it up. 10 seconds to go. That's it. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. That's okay, keep it up. So next we've got our plank. So on our hands and our elbow, no elbows and our feet. So getting ready, you've got five seconds and then our lovely plank shape. Ready in three, two, one and go. Well done, that's it. Good job. That's it, you're almost, you're halfway through already, so keep it up. That's it, well done. 10 seconds to go. Keep it going. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest, well done. The next one is our squat jacks. Um, Josie, if you've got sore knees, just do the first few seconds, then you can stop. Right, so squat jacks, so bums nice and low, feet apart, and then back together. Ready in three, two, one, go. Josie might just do the first few seconds because she's got quite sore knees today, so she's just gonna go through the first few to show you if you're unsure. 
That's it. Keep it up. So bum's nice and low. I'll tell you when to stop, don't worry. Keep it going. So bum's nice and low, feet apart, and then back together. Good job. Well done, everybody. Five seconds to go. Three, two, one, and rest. Well done. We're back to our plyo jumps. And is this our third round? So you've only got one more round of this one and then you'll be halfway through your workout. So back to our plyo jump. So one foot in front, bending out knee as much as possible and jumping up. Ready, in three, two, one, and go. That's it. Well done. So try and get that knee as close to the floor as possible and then jump up tall. <laughs> That's it, keep going. Nice and tall. Halfway there, keep going. That's it. I'm really proud of you all, so keep working really hard for me. Make those, that lunge nice and wide. Three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Next, we've got our plank shape. So you've got two more exercises, so you've got a 30 second rest. So work really hard for the next minute. Getting ready in three, two, one and go. So our planks, so keep our bums nice and low, keep our backs nice and straight. That's it. Well done, everybody. 10 seconds in. You're working really hard. That's it. Halfway there. Try and keep your tummies really squeezed here. So really squeeze nice and tight for me. Five, four, three, two, one and rest, well done. Right, the last exercise we've got is our squat jacks. So, last 30 seconds of exercise, and you've got a whole 30 seconds rest. Ready, in three, two, one and go. Squat jacks, bums nice and low for me. Keep those legs bent. <laughs> That's it, keep going. So, bums really low for me. Don't let those legs straighten. Well done, keep working. Good job. 10 seconds to go. That's it. Well done, last five seconds of work and then you've got to rest. Three, two, one, and rest. You've got 30 seconds. Well done, everybody. You're already halfway through your workout for today. So good job. Grab yourself a drink, you've got about another 20 seconds to go, and then we're going back to our squat jumps, our press-up jacks, and our rebound jumps. But this time we've got two rounds, so slightly easier this time. 10 seconds to go. Make sure you're breathing lots. Five, four, squat jumps, three, two, one. And our big squat jumps, remember our explosive power off the floor. Push up as high as you can. Well done. Make sure you're using your arms. Look at what Josie's arms are doing, because that is what helps us get really high. Good job. You're halfway through already, everybody, so keep it up. Well done. Super work. Keep going. Push those knees forwards. Three, two, one, and rest. Super work. Right. Next, we've got our press-up jacks. So in our press-up shape, feet apart, feet together. Getting ready in five seconds. Three, two, one, and go. Nice fast feet here, staying on our toes, keeping our ankles really strong. Keeping our backs really strong. Don't let that bum creep up. It's really easy here, but I really want you to remember your shapes. You're halfway through already, everybody, so good work. That's it, 10 seconds to go. Super job. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Next, we've got rebound jump. So, hands either up by your ears or just by your sides. Pushing off the floor, ankles together, nice straight knees. Ready in three, two, one, and go. That's it. So nice jumps for me. The most important thing here is to keep your ankles together. I don't care if you don't get up very high, I just want you to squeeze those ankles the whole time. Good work. That's it. Well done, you're over halfway through this exercise now. 
Good job. Nearly done. Three, two, one, and rest. Good job, right. You've got one more round, then you get a 30 second rest. So we're going back to our squat jumps. So big explosions off the floor for me, everybody. Getting ready in three, two, one, and go. So really powerful off the floor. That's it, everybody. Good work. Super job. Really push off that floor for me. That's it. Keep it up. You're halfway there, everybody. That's it. Keep going. Keep those legs apart. Push your knees forwards over your toes. Finishing in three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Next, we're in our press-up shape, going back to our press-up jack. So, again, the most important thing here is to keep our bodies nice and tight throughout the whole exercise. Getting ready in three, two, one, and go. So, nice fast feet for me here. Good job. Keep it up. You've got less than a minute of exercise before you get your lovely 30 second rest. So, work really hard for me. That's it. Good job. Halfway through this already. That's it, so keep your bums low, don't let them creep up. Well done. Finishing in five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Right, that's one round to go. So we're going back to our squat jump. We have done this is number one, isn't it? Oh, we've got straight jumps next. <laughs> I can't do anything. So straight jumps, ready in three, two, one. One and go, rebound jumps. This is your last exercise before we get our lovely long rest. So nice, fast rebound jumps. Keeping those legs nice and tight, squeezing those ankles together. Well done. Halfway through already. That's it, keep going. You've got 10 seconds and you've got a 30 second rest. Keep those legs really tight for me. Five, four, three, two, one and rest well done grab yourself a drink you're well over halfway through this workout now so we're going back to our plyo jumps our plank and our squat jacks so again two rounds of these work as hard as you can i know it's really warm but you're all doing a really good job so keep it up you've got 10 seconds to go till we're going for our plyo jumps getting ready in five four three two, one, and plyo jump. So one foot in front, let that knee at the back, nearly touch the floor, but just not quite. So make sure you're bending it. That's it, good work, everybody. That's it, keep that up. Good job, everyone, halfway through this. Well done. Keep it up, everybody, keep working. Five, four, three, two, one, well done. Right, into our plank. So on our elbows, bums nice and low, keeping our lovely flat back shape. So getting ready in five, four, three, two, one, and plank. So on our elbows, nice flat backs, keeping our tummies really tight. This is a good one for working on our core muscles. So squeeze those tummies, good job. Keep this up, everybody. You're halfway through it already. So that's it. Squeeze your ankles together if they're not already. Squeeze, squeeze your tummy, squeeze your bums, squeeze your shoulders. Finishing in three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Right, we're into our squat jacks, and then that's round one completed. So remembering keep our bums nice and low, and then we're just jumping our feet apart and back together. Ready in three. Two, one, and go. So feet, that's it. So keep those legs nice and bent for me the whole time. Don't let them straighten. That's it. Keep them nice and spent. Just let them come together and apart. Like you're doing star jump, but with spent legs. That's it. Halfway through this already, everybody. Good job. Finishing in five, four, three, two, 
One and rest. Well done. Right, one more round of these to go and then you get a 30 second rest. So we're going back to our plyo jumps. I know this is a really hard one. I just want you to try your best. Getting ready in three, two, one and go. That's it. Keep it up. Bend that knee as much as you can, but don't let it touch the floor. That's it. Keep working. Good job, everybody. That's it. Well done. Take it a bit slower if you need to. That's okay. Finishing up in five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Good job, everybody. Right. We're going into our planks next. You've got one more minute of exercise and then you get a 30 second rest. Right. <laughs> Are you okay, Lola? <laughs> okay. Getting ready in three, two, one, and go. <laughs> so that's it in our nice plank shape. Just try your best here. Squeeze those tummies. That's it. I'm seeing some fantastic shapes here, everybody. Good work. Make sure your shoulders are in line with those elbows. You nearly finished this one already. Keep it up. Less than 10 seconds to go. Finishing in three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Right, last one for this round, then you get 30 second rest. We're doing our squat jacks. And I might even be at night, I might give you a minute rest after this. So as I see everyone working really hard, you get a whole minute rest. Ready in three, two, one, and go. Squat jacks. Work really hard and you get a whole minute to rest. Oh, this is looking really good, everybody. Super work. Keep it up. 20 seconds. You're on your way to a one minute rest at this point. That's it. 10 seconds to go. Good job. Keep those legs nice and bent. Five, four, three, two, one. You've got a whole minute to rest, everybody. So get yourself a drink. That's it. You've all worked really hard. And the good news is you've only got six more exercises to do and then you are finished for today. So keep it up. That's it. Well done. If you need to put your hands above your head to get some air in, you can. If you need to get yourself a nice big drink, you've got plenty of time. You've still got over 30 seconds. So we're going into our last round of exercises. We're going back to our squat jumps. Remember what we said last week, that the last round is just as important as the first round. So I really want you to try as best as you can to do as many as possible. You've got, just done, you've got about 15 seconds to go and then we're going into our squat jumps. Getting ready in 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and squat jumps. Nice and big. If I see everyone working really hard, you can have a minute between this and the next exercises as well. So work really hard for me. Good job, everybody. This is it. Make sure you're pushing those knees right over your toes. Super work. 10 seconds to go. Remember to really explode through the floor. Finishing in three, two, one, and rest. Well done, you've got 15 seconds. Then we're going into our press-up jacks. Keep this up. Your work ethic is fantastic. You're all doing yourselves really proud. Getting ready in three, two, one, and go. Press-up jacks. Nice fast feet, nice flat backs. That's it, good work. Keep those bums nice and low. Don't let your bum creep up. That's it, well done everybody. Halfway through already. That's it, 10 seconds to go. That's it, nearly done. Finishing in three, two, one and rest, well done. One more exercise, you've got rebound jumps and then you're gonna get another minute to rest. Cause I'm in a good mood today and I feel like being nice. Getting ready in three, two, 
One and go. Nice rebound jumps for me. Worked really hard for 30 seconds and then you've got a whole minute to rest. So that's it. Feet together, squeeze those ankles together. Nice and tight. Well done. Halfway through this already. Keep it up. That's it. Good work, everybody. Less than 10 seconds to go. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Well done. You've got a minute. Grab yourself a drink. Hands over your head. Lots of air. You're all working fantastically, which is really good in this heat. I'm very proud of all of you. That's it. So the last set of exercises we've got to do, we've got a minute and a half of exercise left. Just one minute and a half. So you're gonna do your plyo jumps, followed by our plank, followed by our squat jacks. All you've got to do, you've got 30 seconds of rest left, so make sure you're getting lots of water. That's it. Just over 20 seconds to go. Give yourself a shake. Make sure you're ready. Tell yourself, I'm a fantastic gymnast and I'm going to be able to do my next set of conditioning easily. 10 seconds to go. Finishing it, oh no, starting with our uh, plyo jumps in three, two, one, and go. Nice big jumps for me. Letting that knee bend, but not touch the floor. That's it. Well done, everybody. Good job. You're halfway through this round one already. Good work. Good job, everyone. Keep it up. Finishing in three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Next, we've got our plank. So onto our hands and our feet. Just gonna hold your plank shape. Got about five seconds. Starting in three, two, one, and go. So hands and uh, elbows and feet. Bums down, so nice flat bodies. Don't let that bum creep up. Squeeze your core muscles. Good job. Should be nice and still here. We're doing a static hold, so squeeze that core. You're over halfway through. Keep it up. You're all doing fantastically. Keep working. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Right, you are on to your last 30 seconds of exercise, everybody. Last 30 seconds. That's all you've got left. So we're doing our squat jacks. So 30 seconds and then you're done. Ready in three, two, one, and go. Last 30 seconds. That's it, keep working, good job. Super work. That's it, last 30 seconds, keep that bum nice and low. Don't let those legs straighten. Good job, 10 seconds to go. Last 10 seconds and then you're finished. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Good job, everybody. Everybody give yourself a super big clap and a pat on the back. That was a really good effort. I know that was really hard, but sometimes we've got to get used to training in unideal conditions because not always are we allowed or are we able to train in the perfect condition. Sometimes it is just a bit too hot. So to be able to do that amount of work when it's quite warm, is really, really good. So well done. We're just gonna finish off with a little bit of splits work because I would like to see everybody splits. So we're just gonna give ourselves a bit of a stretch out. So putting your right foot in front. Can we do a nice long lunge with our elbows on the floor? So our back leg, Joyce, would you mind turning to the side for me? So our back knee should be nice and straight and off the floor. Our elbows are on the floor and we're doing nice and hard work. That's it. Good. Nice. Well done, everybody. Now I just want you to push back into your half split for me. So reaching your, putting your nose on your knee. If that's really easy, reach your hands to your foot and past your foot. Making that stretch as long as you can. Well done. 
That's looking great, guys. Well done. Now I just want you to lean forward slightly, picking your back knee off the floor, or your back toe rather, and just pulling your toe into your bum. Just hold it for as long as you can because it's a bit of a tricky one to hold. And you should be feeling that stretch right along here. That's a good one for stretching the insides of our legs. Well done. Right, let's see these right leg splits then, shall we? Let's have a look. Things I'm looking for in these splits is that our legs are straight, that our toes are pointed, that we've got our bodies nice and straight. So even if we're not flat down in our splits, I don't want to see you hunched over your leg. I want to see you trying to lift your bodies up as straight as you can. If you are flat down in your splits, get those arms out. Show off that you're really good at your splits and that you've worked really hard. Fantastic. Well done, these are looking amazing. Right. Give your legs a shake, swap legs. That's it. Well done. Let's put our left leg in front. And let's get our elbows on the floor, trying to lift that back leg up. Trying to, if we lift our back knee off the floor, it's increasing the stretch in our hips. So we're pushing our hips down to the floor. Good job. Well done. And sitting back into our half splits with our nose on our knee. So your back knee should be on the floor. You should be sitting up a little bit on it. Nose to your knee, hands down on the floor, reaching those hands past your feet if you can. Well done. Super work. Well done. And leaning forwards, picking your back leg off the floor. And pull it into your bum. Super work. Good job, well done. And you can slide into your splits for me. Let's have a look at your left leg. Again, making sure those knees are nice and straight and that our toes are pointed, trying to keep our backs nice and straight. Well done, I can see that a lot of people have worked really hard on these splits. They're looking fantastic. Well done. Right. And to finish off, let's see your box split. So if you need to do your frog's legs first, give your legs a bit of a shake, warm them up, that's fine. So stretch out your frog's legs, and then let's have a look at your box splits. Box splits tend to be our least favourite, but we've got to keep working on them because they're really good for our spraddle jumps. Good job, everybody. Right, let's have a look at our box splits then. So again, trying to keep our legs nice and straight, keeping our bum in line with our legs, so not leaning forwards too much. And let's have a look at your box splits. If you've got flat box splits, the next thing I would like you to try and work on is sitting it up in nice and in straddle and trying to get our legs flat either side of us. I've never managed it, so if you can manage it, you're very impressive. Right, finish up there, give your legs a shake. Now, again, well done today. I'm sure many of you are thinking, Fran, that was horrible. You made me do so much work. But I promise you, it will all be for the good in the end. So give yourselves a big clap. Well done. Good work today. I was very proud of you all. And I will see you very, very soon, hopefully. Bye-bye, everybody.